Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Redgrass Channel. Welcome back to another Duel Links video. Today, we're going to be challenging the one and only Ishizu Ishtar. I unlocked her uh, earlier this week, and I've only dueled her once. We've also got Odeon as well, which I'll also need to do as well, because I don't think I've actually dueled him on the channel yet. We're going to go to, Ish to Ishizu. Uh, we're going to do a level 30 duel because I'm not too confident in. Beating her at level 40 yet because I haven't actually played at level 40 yet. I don't really want to do that for a video and just you know lose incredibly hard because she does use Grave Keepers. Um, and depending on how her deck is up at level 40, it could be really, really, really tough. But she doesn't like have Necro Valley straight away, which is kind of weird. We did draw into our favorite card, two Restructor Revolutions, which is going to give us a very nice early advantage there. With uh, some what, like eight, 1600 points of damage right off the bat. I mean, Dragon Zombies are going to be placed very soon because um, Joey Beans Man, I think, got added to the new set, the Neo Impact set. And I think also I've got a couple of the Cannon Soldiers, the 1650 Cannon Soldier things, uh, which I'll, uh, I'll be adding in instead of those because those are pretty decent. Should have really set her face down so we could get some effect. What's with this was Gravekeeper's Vassal, which didn't really do much. Maybe I should have done a level 40 duel. Okay, she's got Cannon Hold over that. that. No, she's just, yeah, that's the one that lets us do Tribute 1 and deal 700 points of damage, I believe. Is that it? Yes, 700 points of damage to the opponent. This has been very, very, very easy. So you know what we'll do, because I'm nice, we're going to go into the level 40 duel and see what happens, just just for, you know, just to see what happens. I'm, I'm currently trying to level up Kaiba, um, I've got a new card, I've got Agido. I'm trying to, currently trying to level up Kaiba's character because I've done uh, Yugi's to the max, I, I, don't look. I think I've done Yugi to the max and Joey to the max, have I? Yeah, I've done Joey to the max and Yugi to the max, so I'm leveling up Kaiba's character through this and take us through the special event that's on right now. Let's go. Let, let's go to the the duel again. Let's go to level forty. We could get a blast held by tribute, which would be nice. Quite a few of those cards would be nice, to be fair. Let's see if we can beat Ashizu's level forty deck. I highly doubt it. I could have just made some changes actually to make it a little bit easier for me, but like it would have been nice to actually put in some of the gate guardian pieces instead of something like Judge Man. Hmm. Then again, those are two trees instead of one, so. I don't believe in any. Kaiba, I have already seen that you will lose this duel to me. Duel. duel. My turn. My I'm not too convinced on her voice acting. I don't know if it's the same person did the original uh, in the English dub, but it doesn't sound as on point, right? So Necro Valley was a dude. All graves monsters gain fire attack and defense. Cards in either player's graves cannot be banished, negate any card effect that remove a card in the graveyard. Let's play stop defense just to see what that is because with that 500 attack point bonus, um, that's gonna make things incredibly difficult. Yeah, exactly. Um, so we're gonna set magical arm shield and we're also going to set arsenal summoner just so we've got some defense. Hopefully, she summons something else out to the field so we can, you know, take control of one of them. But she didn't, unfortunately. So we're just going to let it go through because obviously we can't do anything. Arsenal Summon's going to allow us to grab Naturia Guardian. We really need to get rid of that Necro Valley, so if we can draw into a Twister this turn, that'd be fantastic. Come on, Twister. Oh! Believed in the heart of the cards, and it paid off for us big time. There we go, he's down to 1650, which means now we can go, I think we should go with Naturia Guardian, just because it does have that special ability to gain 300 points whenever a monster is uh, summoned to the opponent's side of the field, which will protect us for a little bit. Right of Spirit, target one, go monster in the graveyard, special summon that target, so she's getting that out again. And of course, she's got another Necro Valley in her hand. But she's on Great Keeper's Priestess as well. I shall attack my monster's effect activates. Wait, so what's that do? 
change the target's battle position, however. I'll take Joel Gregor's Priestess and make it attack that instead. I know I'm going to take the damage, I should have done it the other way around, but I don't really want to lose my Naturia Guardian this turn. Just in case we draw into something like Judge Man, because that will get over that thing, but we didn't, unfortunately, which is very disappointing. Just going to have to go on the defense for now. We haven't got another Twister in the deck, unfortunately. And Rise Spirit is getting that back again, so now this is going to have, yeah, three insanely decent monsters here. So we're going to be taking some damage here, we're going to take 1900, it does look like we're going to lose this duel because there's no way we can actually be able to take down any of those three. Um, I do have the draw sense skill for drawing a spell card, but at this point in time it really wouldn't matter what we drew because it would either be Destructive Evolution, which wouldn't have my help, or um, the one that gives all monsters 200 attack points on my field, or it would have been um, the Mask of the one that uh, stops a monster from attacking and deals on five dollars damage during every one of my spell my phases. But we did lose, unfortunately. We weren't good enough to take down the level 40 deck of Ishizu just yet. Going to keep working on that. You got, no, heavy Strata, if your deck has three or more level 5 monsters with different names, you have improved chances of having a level 5 or higher monster in your starting hand. That's really useful. That is really useful actually. Um, but we're going to end it there for today. I'm going to keep working on my deck of course and trying to level up as much as possible. We're going to keep grinding out that special event that's happening right now. Remember that's you know that's still on for the next couple of days so get in the uh, PP arena get some your gem bonuses for that the gem bonuses aren't too great for that event um, which is why I'm probably not going to be playing it too much but yeah thanks for watching don't forget to comment and subscribe if you do feel like sharing this Facebook Twitter that'd be absolutely fantastic thanks for watching and I will see you all in the next Dawnings video see you then